Atlanta United players finally get a chance to meet their new head coach, Gonzalo Pineda. He led his first practice today since getting the job. He was hired almost two weeks ago, but had to quarantine after testing positive for COVID. CBS 46's sports reporter Emily Gagnon live right now, and he joins the team in the midst of a four-game winning streak. Pretty good. Yeah, Gonzalo Pineda, he's coming at the right time. Atlanta United on a four-game win streak, and it's been two years. Yeah, two years since they last won four in a row. So he's pretty lucky to be getting here right when they're hot and confident. Guys, in his opening statement today, he said that he could really feel the energy out there during training, and it's true because I could feel it too. Players, they were loud, they were laughing, they were smiling. Communication was really good. You know, they were working hard to impress their new coach. And when I say that they were laughing and smiling, cheering each other on, it hasn't always been like that at practice this season. They were on a franchise record 12 game win league streak before beating reigning MLS Cup champion Columbus Crew to start turning things around. This group's confidence is high. It's important to keep it there. Pinetta knows that. This is the first training session with the club for him because you know what? He was hired the 12th had coronavirus, so there was a delay in getting him to Atlanta, but now he's here and he's ready to go. He helped me in some ways. It's not what we planned, certainly, but uh, obviously gave me some time to probably prepare a couple of things, a couple um, meetings, a couple uh, uh, introduction meetings with other people and uh, watching the, the, the players from outside, from the TV, sometimes gives you a couple different perspective, but obviously it was an idea. Yeah, now that Pineda is actually here in Atlanta with his players, he needs to set up a bunch of meetings with them in person to set up expectations. And before I leave you, if you take a look at the standings, right, Atlanta United and D.C. United, they are tied in points for the seventh and final playoff spot. But Atlanta United is in eighth place because of tiebreakers. That's why it was so important to get a new coach in here very fast because there's still a lot to play for. Kieran. All right. We love it. Thank you so much, Emily.